Corvo, if only there was someone else I trusted to send, so that you could remain near. But there is no one else, and the Spymaster was right to insist that I send you. The plague has taken so many, and we must find a cure. When you are near, my heart is at peace. Emily and I will count the days until you return. Hurry home, and bring good news. Steady hand. That's it. Watch it. Cast off line. Casting off. We're away. Take us straight to Dunwall Tower. Lord Corvo has news for the Empress, and we've come a long way. A long way to bring bad news. The sailors say there's a curse on us. Black magic. Superstition. For all we know, there's a cure for the plague by now. Maybe. We live in strange times. Sending the Empress's bodyguard away for a couple of months. That's unusual. Well, this was important. We need help with the rat plague.
know what to do next time? Welcome back, Lord Protector. Her Majesty is waiting in the pavilion. Hello, sir. Orvo, you're back! Will you tell me about your trip, please? Were there any whales? Wait! Let's play hide and seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. You have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. Okay, here we go. Run with me! Ooh. Did you see any monsters while traveling to the other aisles? My nanny says the big ocean's full of them, but I think she only says that to scare me. Let's see if you're so good at this. I'll hide my eyes and count, and at the end of the countdown, I'll try and find you. Okay, I'm going to count to ten. Find a place to hide. You should go now, so Mother can see you too. Ugh. Let's go! Come on! While you were gone, Mother seemed very sad. I think she missed you. Welcome home, Lord Protector. Stop moving, Campbell. And you, Corvo, welcome back. From wherever you've been. They sent him all around the Isles to beg for aid. A waste of time. My elixir will banish the plague from this city. Now keep still a moment, High Overseer Campbell. I'm not so sure that painting looks like Campbell. What are you doing? I need the bottle to draw the eye away from Campbell. I suppose I can paint him without the cider, eh? though in truth he is always close to this stuff. Thank you. I have to She'll see you at decision. once. He says to bring a bottle, I bring a bottle. He says to bring food, I bring food. <coughs> it's been good traveling with you, Corvo. Hello, my lord. They're sick people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, your majesty. They're... They're my citizens, and we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, your majesty. Corvo, two days early, full of surprises, as usual. Follow me, Captain. We should leave them alone. Things are bad. Could the city get any worse? 
Never doubt it. It's a fair wind that brings you home to me. What news have you brought? I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before, knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. Cowards. They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Yes, don't worry, darling. Mother is fine. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them away? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? What? Emily, come here! Thank you. If you hadn't been here... No more! Not again! Mommy! No! Get away from her! Corvo! Uh, 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 Mommy! Uh, get away! Corvo! Corvo! It's all coming apart. Fine. Find Emily. Protect her. You're the only one who'll know what to do. Won't you? Corvo. Ward us all. Look at what he's done. Yes, he's killed the Empress. What did you do with young lady Emily, traitor? Her own bodyguard. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Peg him. Chance, Corvo. Sign the confession and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. That's enough for now. Get out. Let's give the man some time to think. Corvo, the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away, and no one will ever know the truth. Yes, unlucky you. Tomorrow you'll be executed, but it's for a good cause. This country needs strong leadership now, someone to guide the weak. And that's where we come in. There was nothing personal in this, even though you almost sank our plans. But it turned out well. You were in the wrong place the right time, and someone has to take the fall. Goodbye, Corvo. God! Take him back to his cell. You should eat, Corvo. This meal comes from a friend.
I tell you about the time I almost caught that guy who killed the Empress? I don't need shit from you. How come so many people are coming to the execution tomorrow? It's on account of Corvo, the one who killed the Empress and abducted her daughter, Emily. So it's an occasion. Right. A social event for the High and Mighty. Come see the noble Lord Protector get his head chopped off. They're as bad as us betting on the dogfights. Attention. The sun. off-limits to maintenance crews, unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance, with one week's notice. Seen any more big rat swarms? Shut up. Solitary wing is off limits to maintenance crews unless accompanied by an officer of the wall. Empty. Solitary wing must be. 
scheduled in advance, with one week's notice. Tomorrow's execution will be restricted to the personnel assigned to the event and approved dignitaries only. Unconscious again. Though he's taken more punishment than any two men we've brought in for interrogation. When he wakes, we'll start again. Having him sign the confession for her murder isn't critical, but it might be useful to us later. The assassination of an empress is not a trivial matter. Lazy slug. Attention. Tomorrow's Sorry. execution Not will yet. be restricted to the personnel assigned to the event yesterday. and approved Again. dignitaries only. Reports trouble for both of us. I'm moving. Here, Morris was dragged off by the overseers for some black magic nonsense? Bug someone else. Oh, no, stupid goddamn. Don't find someone. Nasty furry pill. Attention. The solitary wing is off limits to maintenance unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice.
attention. Tomorrow's execution will be restricted to the personnel assigned to the event and approved dignitaries only. execution is tomorrow, right? Yeah, but everything has to be set up today. I can't wait to see his head roll. Not everyone did, but I really like the Empress. Attention! The solitary wing is hey. off limits to maintenance crew, you got unless accompanied by an Shut officer up. of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. Corvo's execution is tomorrow, right? Yeah, but everything has to be set up today. I can't wait to see his head roll. Not everyone did, but I really like the Empress. Attention! The solitary wing is off-limits to maintenance crews, unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance. With one week's notice. <laughs> assigned to the event and approved dignitaries only. unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice.
restricted to the personnel assigned to the event and approved dignitaries only. Some down here by the look of it. Right. If we're lucky, one of them will get Corvo. You're afraid of him? He's Sir Conan. It's all merchants and whores down there. Kids like you, you never saw what he was like. I saw him fight three to one in the practice yard.
how we're supposed to load the bodies and the carts headed to the flooded district? Yeah, screw that. That's too far. I don't want to catch the flood, do you? No. Doesn't the elixir prevent it? Maybe. Either way, let's just dump them down there. Like the rats eat. Attention Dunwall citizens, the assassin Corvo, responsible for the murder of our fair Empress and the disappearance of Lady Emily, heir to the throne, has temporarily escaped state custody. Any evidence as to his whereabouts must be delivered to the City Watch at once.
won't get past me, sir. Do you know who we're hunting here? Don't try to take them out alone. But what if no one from the squad is around? Then try to make a lot of noise when you die. Knock something over if you can. Bastard. Smells like a dead weeper in here. Won't get past me, sir. Do you know who we're hunting here? Don't try to take them out alone. But what if no one from the squad is around? Then try to make a lot of noise when you die. Knock something over if you can. Bastard. Smells like a dead weeper. <laughs> Did you hear Morris was dragged off by the Overseers for some black mat? Stay alert, you worms. He's not getting out this way on my watch.
drone has temporarily escaped state custody. Any evidence? Bravo. Over here. I'm Samuel, and I work for some good people who want very much to meet you. Well, they said you'd come out here. I can still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them. Just down the river from here. This is the Hound Pits pub, closed for business. Half the district marked off is dead from the plague. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose, and he don't know a thing. Of course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. Take you up to meet Admiral Havelock and the rest of the loyalists. The Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name, he can. I expect they're hard at work in there. Best join them. So it's starting up. Well, get whoever really killed the Emperor man. Six months in Cold Ridge Prison, he slipped out like it was nothing. We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvo, I'm Admiral Havelock. A true servant of the Empire, like you. Until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going to come out with it. We've been building a coalition of loyalists, aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered. But before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times, but his industrious mind buys him that right. Yes, Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you rest. I'll be crafting your weapons and gear, all custom work. For you, I will create the tools of a master assassin. No! This cannot happen now the tank of whale oil's run out. Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. The oil's unstable. 
When it explodes, there is a terrible mess. Perfect. Now plug it in. Just perfect. Thank you, Cole. Here, see? The Assassin's Mask. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face. But this mask will mean terror to them. If you just hold still, the fit must be precise. There. Can you see normally? Lens out of alignment. There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Tell me what I can make for you. I advise that you get some sleep. Your life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. Sleep well.
Corvo. Your life has taken a turn, has it not? The Empress is dead, her precious daughter Emily is lost somewhere in the city, and you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this I have chosen you, and drawn you into the void. I am the Outsider, and this is my mark. There are forces in the world and beyond the world, great forces that men call magic, and now these forces will serve your will. Use this newfound power, my gift to you. Come find me. that follow, your trials will be great, Corvo. Seek the ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world, and at shrines raised in my name. These runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. To help you find these runes, I give you this, the heart of a living thing, molded by my hands. With this heart, you will hear many secrets, and it will guide you toward my runes, no matter how they may be hidden. Listen to the heart now, and find another rune. How you use what I have given you falls upon you, as it has to the others before you. And now I return you to your world, but know that I will be watching with great interest.